Who said you couldn't beat a dead horse? Uh, this, uh, this horse obviously is not dead. Our present federal territorial relationship uh, always requires that we have to put the Department of Defense needs, the United States government's needs versus the people of Guam's needs. And so for the governor to want to convene the Guam First Commission, uh, I'm encouraged. Governor Eddie Calvo explained that because the Guam First Commission was found to be inorganic by the AG's office because it doesn't provide for a separation of powers, he will expand the idea of the Guam First Commission to include all senators as opposed to a few representatives. If there are issues regarding executive authority, uh, the governor will be there. And then if there are issues that are regarding a legislative authority, then all the legislators have been invited to participate as well. The governor is trying to create a forum that contains in it the spirit of the Guam First Commission but does not violate the Organic Act separation of powers. The way around, he believes, to work around the separation of powers doctrine is to invite every single member of the legislature um, at that meeting, and I think that's great.